Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Cinnamon Stitches. Bentley, stop. I'm your yarn host, Jennifer. Bentley is not in his crate right now. He's actually sitting on the floor next to me. In case you don't know, you're new here. Bentley is my new puppy. He's about 12 weeks old right now and he is a handful. And he's trying to eat my box that's on the floor. <laughs> so, if you hear crunch, 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 that's little Benny Boo. <laughs> So today, I know that Thursday is usually P.O. Today's not P.O. I don't know what to call Universal Yarn. Um, um, let's see, Universal Yarn of the Week. I don't even know how to pronounce that. <laughs> you yow! <laughs> I don't even know. I placed a small order with Universal Yarns. I already unbagged this. I already recorded this video. I'm re-recording it because I did not. I was not satisfied with the the way I handled the video. <laughs> so we're we're having a redo. Redo. All right. This order is not very big. I got one, two, three, four, five. I got six skeins of yarn. Um, the total for six skeins of yarn was a lot of money. It was a lot of money. I'm just gonna be honest. This was not cheap yarn. This is bougie upper class yarn. This is like local yarn shop yarn. It's wool. <laughs> I spent a lot on this yarn. I have been wanting some of these yarns for a long time now. Some longer than others because some of these are new yarns. Um, but yeah, I wanted to show you guys what I ordered, what I bought, what is on the market, what is available to you if you like higher end yarns, if you can afford higher end yarns, if you like working with wools. Universal is a yarn that you can very easily find in a lot of local yarn shops. I'm just going to let him chew on that. <laughs> it's not anything that can hurt him. Um, what was I saying? Oh, and you can also buy these yarns on universalyarn.com. If you do not know what Universal Yarns is, Universal Yarn is a... It's a, it's a sister company or the mother company to Premier Yarns. They're housed in the same warehouse in North Carolina. I've been inside the warehouse. <laughs> this is not a affiliate thing at all. I am affiliated with Premier, but I have chosen not to be affiliated with Universal just because I don't buy from them very often because they are a higher end yarn. They are a little more pricier and they are wool and not everybody likes to work with wool. Not everybody can afford to work with this type of wool. So with all of that in mind, I'm showing you these yarns and don't be gobsmacked by the price, <laughs> okay? So to start off with, this color burst yarn has been out for a while now and I have had my eye on it because it is just absolutely, just absolutely stunning. So this is Universal Color Burst. Um, it is, I need my glasses, but my glasses have a big giant scratch down the center of the lens. I have needed new glasses for about a year now and I just have not done it. <laughs> 200 gram ball, 660 yards. 65% uh, super wash merino wool, 35% acrylic. It feels like wool. Uh, it's not a super soft wool either but it's really, really pretty, and I want to make myself something beautiful out of this. So I actually got two of these, and this is the Colorway Sunset. This retails for $21. I got it on sale. I got 20% off, and that is the lowest price I've seen this since it's been out, so I snatched it up seeing that it was 20% off. It is no longer 20% off. I think it was a Black Friday sale that this was 20% off, I think. I know it was on sale, but yeah. So I placed this order on 11-21. So whatever day that was, <laughs> whatever. Let me look at my calendar. It took no time at all to get here, but that's because I'm five hours from their warehouse. Calendar, November 21st. No, that was the Monday before Thanksgiving. So I don't know if it was a um, Thanksgiving week sale or what, but isn't this so pretty? It's so beautiful. Bentley, you were just shredding that paper, huh? So, I got two of those. Like I said, I've wanted those for a long time. I've seen them in several local yarn shops to me. And the, the price has always been $20, $21, $22, $24. And so when it was 20% off, I was like, yeah, I'm going to take that. Because 
case you don't know, that's like $4 off. That's a pretty good deal. So I saved $8 on the two of those. And then next, the Deluxe Stripes has been out for a while, I think. I really honestly thought this was going to be acrylic. I did not read the description box. I could have swore the Deluxe Stripes was acrylic yarn. And I'm totally 100% wrong. <laughs> it is wool. So... The Deluxe Stripes is 100 grams, 3.5 ounce ball, 218 yards. Oh, I forgot to say, this is a lightweight number three. This is a medium worsted. 75% um, superwash wool, 25% nylon, machine wash, cold, gentle, tumble dry, low, which we love that we can throw it in the washer and dryer as long as we're careful. Um, I got two in this colorway. This is the color poinsettia. Funny story, me and Mr. Cinnamon got married at a place in Ventura County, California called Poinsettia Pavilion. So <laughs> the name is kind of sentimental to me, and I also really love Christmas yarn. So I got two of these. These were not on sale. These were $12 a ball. Hey, stop chewing on everything. Where is your ball? Come here. This dog, man, yesterday I was on the bed. Come here. Come here. I was on the bed crocheting and I had my yarn it ball thing with my balls of yarn in it and he saw the ball of yarn twirling in the ball the yarn it ball and he pounced on it and batted it off the bed like he was a cat I just was laughing I was like dog listen <laughs> you are not a cat you are not a cat so anyway I know cannot focus when there's puppies around tell me you could focus if there's a cute little puppy at your feet <laughs> so that is a beautiful red, white, and green. Again, this is a wool. It's not a soft wool. As a matter of fact, this one is softer than this one. But I really like this, and I wanted it in my life. And so, you know, they also had this color is new. This is also the Deluxe Stripes. This is the color tie-dye. And this is like my jam. This is my jam all day long. Isn't that pretty? So I don't know what I'm going to make out of any of this. Because I'm not a big fan of wool hats because I'm hot all the time. And wool does not, it makes me sweaty. <laughs> so this is not going to be hats. I have no idea what this is going to be. I was actually thinking about like Christmas stockings or like, you know, something like that. Something Christmassy out of this. I don't know what I'm going to make out of these. But like I wanted to splurge and buy myself some nice wool. And I did. So like I said, these were $12 a ball each. But they are super washed. So... I mean, you pay for what you get, right? And those colors are so pretty. And this I am so in love with. And I'm so, I am so, so happy that I got this for myself. Like I said, this has been on my list for a while. And I just could not spend the 20-some dollars on it. Because, you know, <laughs> I can get a beautiful hand-dyed hanker yard for the same price. <laughs> but this is, and that, 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 theory makes no sense in my head either because this is 660 yards okay so i got 1200 yards here i think i don't know what i'm gonna make i don't know what i'm gonna make see i always get these ideas i'm like oh i want to make a sweater or a cardigan or something like that here's the problem i'm a 4x so it takes significantly way more yarn to make myself a sweater or something big like that and then i always fall back on like okay well i guess i'll make a shawl shawls that i don't really wear <laughs> <laughs> shawls that end up in the closet or on my Etsy shop you know and so I always have really good intentions but I, I always I'm like okay well now what do I make with that what do I make with that so I don't know maybe I'll just have to buy a couple more and make myself a beautiful sweater although I can make myself like a sleeveless short cardigan I'm sure that this would work I don't know ideas ideas gotta come up with ideas for myself so check out universal yarns i will link their website below i will not link the individual yarns i don't have an affiliate through this company this was just something i purchased for myself because that yarn was on sale and yeah so with that i'm gonna let you guys go i know it was a quick little video man my cameras have been going off for the past two days i am like grand central it's either my cameras are going off because there's somebody outside or my phone is ringing. I'm so, I am Miss Popular. Miss Popular. <laughs> I'm Miss Popular. What can I say? Um, I have no idea what I was saying. Something about not being an affiliate. Not, whatever. I paid this for this yarn myself. <laughs> I treated myself. 
Not that I needed it, but like when your fam when when you have a yarn on your list and you have had it on your list for a long time and it goes on sale, you have to jump on it. You have to. And then that gave me the excuse to buy these so that I could get free shipping. Because I'm pretty sure I got free shipping. Because like eighty five dollars. Yep, I got free shipping. So I guess that was my excuse. I'm like, okay, well, I'm already spending like thirty some dollars. I might as well buy the other yarns I've really been wanting and get free shipping. So <laughs> with that, I'm letting you go check out Universal Yarns if you like higher end yarns. They will sometimes. I'm telling you, you gotta check out their website on occasion. They will have clearance sales. And I think they have some on sale right now. Let's check. New tab. Universalyarn.com They will sometimes have like killer sales on yarn. Um, so they have some cotton true sport on their, their website for $3.50. Um, hanks of cotton, like a really squishy cotton for five bucks. Hanks. Look. <laughs> five bucks. I don't know, say five bucks. Yeah, five bucks. See, five dollars. I have some of this Cotton True Sport. It's really soft. These little tiny balls, though. Um, they have Deluxe Worsted Last Chance Color in a Hank. This is two five fifty five for a Hank of Wool. This wool is kind of scratchy, but that's a really good price if you get the lighter colors. You can over-dye them for yourself if you're careful not to felt them. Um, they also have the Deluxe Chunky for $4. So you can get some Hanks of Yarn for a really good price right now. And like I said, these wools, they're sturdy wools. They're not real soft, but if you don't mind working with a scratchy wool, like those are a really good deal. Um, let's see. Yeah, they have, they have quite a few things on here for like $4 for Uptown Suit. I have both of these. Uptown Baby Sport is $4.25 and the Uptown Super Bulky, I have some of that as well, is $4.25. Both of those are really, really soft. I believe they're both anti-pilling acrylic. Really good deal. So, And then they have all of their leather mud products on sale, um, which is like leather handbags and stuff like that. So check out Universal or not, like whatever. <laughs> <laughs> but I wanted to show you guys what I had purchased so that you guys can see some more yarns on the market and get an opinion on these. These are beautiful, but these are um, not soft wool. They're they're just wool. I mean, they are super wash wool, but they're like they got toothiness to them. And while this is absolutely beautiful, it's got great yardage. Although this is definitely softer than that one. It's definitely softer. It's not like super scratchy. Like it's got a toothiness to it, but it's not, it's not bad at all. I don't think this one would bother me if it was next to my skin long term. The deluxe stripes would bother me long term because they sweaty and make me itchy. This one, not at all. <laughs> I mean, it's not soft like anti-pilling acrylic, which is what I'm spoiled with, but it's not bad at all. It's not bad. At 660 yards is a lot. You can make a lot. You can make a whole shawl with that. So... With that, I'm going to let you go, and I will see you in the next one. Tomorrow is Friday, and Friday is Yarn Born Friday! And I have a red bag from Canada. <laughs> you guys are going to want to see this. <laughs> All right, I'll see you tomorrow. Bye, guys.